My name is Mr. Lamb. You've made two mistakes. First, I have enough resources to find my daughter without uninvited assistance. And second, you should have killed me by now. My men inform me that this disc Jin left for you is encrypted. You will give me the code. I don't have it. Jin played me. He never told me about a code. Then take it. It's yours. You've paid for it with your life. Our business here is done. You may shoot. With pleasure! Come on!
Head for the hotel. We'll need to warn Deke. There's a shitstorm coming. Excuse me, Mr. Decourt. This package arrived for you. Cheers. So, were you both in? Getting hold of Weeming first may be the only way we get out of China alive. Uh, look, Glass, I signed on this gig for one reason, right? The money. We'll still get it. But Weeming is our bargaining chip with Mr. Lamb and the Triad for our lives now. That means we find her first, find her fast, and drop anyone who tries to stop us. Well, that's something then. Right, I'm in. I guess we'll need this. A decryption spike? Here. Thanks, love. What'd you find? Only those deemed worthy will be spared. If Wei Ming is not back among us on the 17th at midnight, we will fail, our fortunes will fail, and our sacrifice will be meaningless. The Fangen cannot allow this to happen. Wei Ming must be found. Ah, Wei Ming's at the center of some big plans for Lamb, eh? Ever hear of this group, the Fongans? No, but many Chinese aristocrats belong to shadow societies unknown to outsiders. After Wei Ming ran away, Mr. Lamb found a correspondence that she had with a Madame Shen. <laughs> We Ming uh, may be trying to reach her now, and I believe you know where you can find Madame Chen. <laughs> Madame Chen? Someone from my past. Is Jin right? Do you know where she is? Up the Haksik River, a town called Shanzi. Madame Chen has a restaurant there. Too right. Now we know why this Jin packer brought this deal to you then, Henny. You got a bleeding inside track. Looks like our odds of getting paid just got better, eh? 